The big bucks flowed thick and fast today as the CEOs of some of Sydney's largest companies raised money to fight childhood cancer. But it wasn't just a matter of reaching for their wallets. First, they had to overcome some of their greatest fears. They rose before dawn to meet the challenge of a dare. 150 captains of industry facing trial by ice bath. Well, I, I can't feel my feet right now. Glass. How did it feel on your feet? Uh, uh, oh, crunchy. Snake. I'm glad his head's facing that way, let's say. And most terrifying of all, circuit fitness. Raising monies for the Children's Cancer Institute. You know, when I was a kid, if you got cancer, it would have been a death sentence. Started by parents of children with cancer in the 70s. The Institute now producing world-leading personalised therapies finding the right drugs for the right child with the right cancer. With a far better chance of getting a better outcome than just taking something off the shelf. Elliston Capital's Brian O'Sullivan knows two stories of childhood cancer. This is my daughter Ella and this is Lexi and Kelly and um, we're actually all in hospital at the same time being treated. Brian has elected to be bathed in snakes. Are you good with snakes? Uh, I'm good with Alan's pythons. You looking relaxed. Um, relaxed, a bit strong. Uh, don't worry, Brian would make it, helping kick the total raised to a million and a half more chances of life. You know, in a time that's been really challenging for heaps of people, to have come through and been able to give back a little bit. Yeah. So How are you feeling now, though? I'm feeling... Feel like you've given? Yeah. Mike Dalton, Nine News.